So we are drawing blood on Sophia to find out if she is pregnant. I'm going to send it into Sage Ag Lab. Our little dairy cow Rosie usually lives with the goats, but I moved her over just while we're doing this blood drawing because having a cow in your face while you're doing that is not awesome. <laughs> But she gets very upset when she's separated from her goats. She she was raised with Sophia and Bianca, and I'm pretty sure she thinks she's a goat. The two most important things you're going to need, a red top tube to put the blood in, and a needle. Now this is a 22 gauge. You can also do 20. And I have several of them in here just in case I end up needing to switch to a fresh needle. And then I also have an Andis electric razor. I'm gonna shave a little patch on their neck so I can see what I'm doing. All right, so this is how you hold the goat so that you can get to the right area. I'm just gonna lift her head like this, kind of tuck it in like that, and then take off her collar. And this area right here is what we're looking at. Right here is the trachea in the middle, and then you can feel the hard muscle on either side and it's right in between. And I shaved a little patch so I can see what I'm doing. And if you just push right here, hold still Bianca, there it goes. You can sort of see as that vein fills up, it gets almost bouncy. So I'm just shaving a little patch right here on the side of the neck. And then you can see right here, the trachea goes down the middle and then you can feel where there's hard muscle on the side and right in between those two is where the jugular vein runs. I am using a 22 gauge needle and I'm gonna just hold right here with my finger and that vein will start to fill up with blood. You can feel it, it's almost bouncy. All right, so then I'm just gonna go in and slightly up and then you can let go. And if you got the vein, it will just start to draw blood. This is a red top tube. It has her name on it. You put the needle in like this. It automatically sucks the blood into the tube. And then when you pull it out, it vacuum seals behind the needle. Once you've got your blood sample, you just need to go on the website, Sage Labs, and get the submission form for whichever type of animal you're sending in samples for. You write the name here, whatever name you wrote on the red top tube, the number of days pregnant, whether you're testing for CAE, CL, or Yoni. The prices are up here in the right hand corner. And then send in a check with it, or you can prepay on the website. It has the address down here of the lab. And I'll put the link for Sage Labs down below. Are you feeding Rocky, Kai? Yeah. Good job. I'm doing it.